Good morning and Shavua Tov. It's Sunday. Hope you had a wonderful Shabbos. So the final blessing of the Amidah concludes with the words, Baruch Ata Hashem, HaMivarech Es Amo Yisrael BaShalom. Blessed are you, God, who, who blesses the Jewish people with the greatest blessing of all, which is the blessing of Shalom, peace. Because as we've been saying all along, without peace, we don't have the ability to contain all the other blessings that we've been davening for, that we've been praying for in the Amida. So it's a simple process just to review. It starts with inner peace, peace within myself, where I do not have inner strife and inner turmoil. I understand who I am. I appreciate who I am. I feel good about myself. I've created a balance between the two major opposing parts within me, which is my body and my soul. I've realized that I have a unique tafkid, a unique purpose in this world, and I am dedicated my life. I'm dedicating my life to fulfilling that purpose, and that involves a spiritual and a physical team that makes up who I am. Then I'm able to take that inner peace that I have and turn to the world, because now that I'm okay with myself and I'm 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 in a place of equilibrium within my own world. I don't feel jealous of other people. I don't begrudge other people success and achievement because I understand that I have my unique purpose in this world and I am focused on fulfilling my purpose and your achievements and your accomplishments do not detract from that. Once we've been able to create a peace, a oneness, a connection with ourselves and with other people, then we are kulano ke'echad, we are unified as one, the Jewish people have become unified because our souls are all connected on the highest level. And when the Jewish people are unified, then we, as the Jewish people, merit to see Or Panecha, Hashem's countenance, Hashem's grace, Hashem's presence in our lives, charging us up, causing us to shine and radiate. And then when the Jewish people shine and radiate, we radiate out unto the world and we act as a light unto the nations, and we show and we lead and we guide and we inspire the nations of the world to understand their role, and ultimately we see the fulfillment of all the blessings that we've been praying for, the coming of Mashiach, and the final ultimate redemption. But it all starts with inner peace within us as individuals, and develops out from there, to ultimately us being able to play, as the Jewish people, being able to play and fulfill our unique mission as a nation in this world, which has always been our unique mission, which is to bring light unto the world, the light of Hashem that shines within us, that we can radiate out unto the world. So that is the, uh, those are the final words of this blessing of the Amidah. One more thought tomorrow to wrap it all up, and then we will move on. Have a great day, everybody.